I'm curious to see the expression of the birds as they eat and chew. Yeah, yeah. You know, feed that is coming from these, obviously, through the milling machine. Yeah, you'll so, see so. Uh -huh. Now, yeah. tell me, how does the process of operating start? Where should a farmer start from? Where you start mm -hmm. is uh, to collect. <laughs> obviously. Number two. Uh -huh. You go to petrol station, if you are using the one, uh, we have two machines, eh? okay. there is one using the engine, petrol, and the other one is using uh, the motor. So, make sure you have uh, your token with you, if you are using motor, make sure you have enough, uh, you have the petrol, you put it on, then uh, you start grinding. That's it? Yeah, it's as simple as that. Okay. Yeah. So, does it need maybe a mat? A, a yeah, you need, you, yeah, you need some, a place where you collect your... Uh, you are uh, flour from, you don't just do it from a uh, dirty place. So you need to prepare a clean place where you will be receiving your uh, end product from. One thing I know about equipment is when you have grinded something with it, it normally comes out hot. Mm -hmm. Does the temperature affect the timing of which you feed the feeds to the chicks or chicken? Now th this one is different from uh, that. Eh? Mm -hmm. You can uh, you can uh, do it and give it. It is the way the machine is uh, uh, made. The only hot place it is the the engine part, and that one is not mixing with the with the feet. The other part is just graded. It comes out with the same temperatures that you put your raw material. With. So you can just do it and give direct to your. Though I told you once we get this one you mix with other ingredients to make it quality mm. fit. Now, I'm so, I am so sorry. I am sure <laughs> as you have gone through your selling, your advising the farmers and all that, you've come across a lot of questions from farmers. Mm -hmm. What are some of those questions? And you can have a chance today to answer them. Yeah, one of the questions they are asking is uh, this one. Can it be, you, you know, when they hear we are talking about the main scope, they think that you just use the main scope alone. So, even if you have the main scope, you will need to have had some amount of mains in it. You will need to have the uh, amount of uh, other ingredients yeah. which we normally, and if I say our farmers, we have, uh, when you come to our inbox, because some uh, things you don't just, like uh, formula, we give we have chicken mash, there is a formula for that. Growers mash, you have a formula for that. Layers mash, uh, chick, start, uh, chick starter, all that. So every stench, you have a formula for that. Mm -hmm. And what do you put in, what do you mix with this one? So th that is a question they, they, are, using, they are asking. Okay. Other questions are very technical about uh, if you are using um, uh, electricity. Mm -hmm. How many faces? Like the one that we use is just a uh, one face. I mean, a single face, because it is the, the machine is very. It's not very big machine, so it uses a very small power. Uh, the other question they are asking is about once you buy that petrol, because now the petrol is very high. If you have those two liters, how many kgs can you get out of it? And uh, if you are doing the, you are doing just normal mains, if you are grading mains, you get up to one ton. That is a thousand mm -hmm. kilograms from two liters of petrol. How many chicken can a thousand kilograms feed? Uh, that is a technical question, mm -hmm. but we have a, we have a program. Uh, a chick, when is day hold? When is one week? We have, we will tell you when you ask us, uh, we will give you, that is an APRA. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. uh, I mean, when you come to us, we will uh, give you the feeding mm -hmm. uh, program. Yeah. Okay. So 1,000, uh, when bird is up after um, three months. So um, when uh, bird is, Mature, mature bird, it will consume 140 grams per day. So, and you feed in the morning and in the evening. So during, in the feeding uh, morning hours, seven grams, evening hours, 
70. So if you have it, if you have that thousand, a thousand kgs, you can calculate that way. Yeah. And that's cost effective. Very, very, very. Okay, nice. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Where can farmers access you? Uh, farmers can uh, get us in our YouTube channel, where we have a lot of trainings. <laughs> we have done a lot of trainings there mm -hmm. about poultry farming. Yeah. Uh, our handle is uh, Joke Chicks Kenya. That is, fa I mean. Um, uh, YouTube, Facebook, the same, Joke FTS Kenya, Twitter, and uh, Instagram. Our phone number is 0710 147 596. Every time when you call us, we will uh, answer your call and help you. Okay, so you can face the camera. And uh, now, uh, come with us as we demonstrate on how to use the machine. I'm going to show you bit by bit, doing uh, for poultry and for other livestock like uh, cattle. So come with us as we do so. So the first thing that you do, if you are doing, uh, if you want the flour, and you are doing this means cost. Today you don't have a lot of them because we have already done the grinding. You take the sieve, you put it here. This is where you put your your sieve, and uh, you carefully do that when the machine is off. So you make sure it, it is well fit. Then uh, you rotate this to make sure this uh, this metal is inside the air. Those are the knives that I'm, I was talking about. They are okay. Then you close it that way. This is what you, you use to close the machine with. And make sure it is very tight. Because when the machine is on, it can open and do some, uh, it can hinge you when you are operating with it. So that way, then uh, the other thing that you are supposed to do is to check if you have the petrol with you before you put on the machine. Eh? So I said it's a very simple machine. Eh? You put on this button. This is the on and off button of the engine if you are using this type of uh, engine. If you read here, you see off and on. So you put on. The other part is here. There are these two arrows. One uh, going forward and the other one going reverse way. One is for the oil. The other one is... Uh, so when you are putting on, you bring this, this, this gear reverse way. And the other one is supposed to be forward. Then you put it on. This is the handle that you use. It's just a normal, like the way you do generally. The concentration the chicken have while feeding the natural grass is enough testament that this machine is indeed a good thing when it comes to agri-technology. The nature of the grass is tasty, fresh, and of course natural. 
Thank you so much for watching today's episode of Mukulima Tech. Tune in to Kate in Farmers TV for more informative shows.